Hey everyone, Eric the Red here. Crypto for the Caffeinated. It's been a hot minute, but seems like we got some good news going. And if you look right there, you'll see that my AMD rig is currently running. Now, why is it running? I thought I shut all my rigs down. I thought I was stopping this. Well, today is May 8th. It's actually technically May 9th, 2019. And as of it's right around midnight and the price of Bitcoin right now is over 6,000. It's a place has been in months and we are going to run a test. 6,000 was sort of a magic number for me before I pulled the plug months ago. Uh, it was the, it was the magic number where I felt if Bitcoin got back to that price, I could start making profit again and it may make sense to start running my machines. Well, I've got both of my beasts resurrected. They are running. Um, I ran all the benchmarks and everything. They finished around midnight. So what I'm going to do is for today, uh, May 9th, I'm going to do a 24-hour test and just see where we're at at the end of this 24 hours. I know things have changed the last few months and rates especially have changed. So we're going to run for 24 hours. And we're going to see what our take is versus what we spent in electricity and see if with a $6,000 Bitcoin, is it financially feasible for me to run my rigs? Well, I'll see you in 24 hours and we'll find out. Tomorrow. Tomorrow for sure. Well, results of our 24-hour test are in. And unfortunately, it's not looking very promising. In the three months or so since I stopped mining on my rigs, the price of Bitcoin has gone up and down, up and down, up and down. And now we're on a bit of a rally. I think we're around 6400 and change as we speak. And while that price has gone up from the approximately $4,000 price it was when I stopped, that doesn't mean mining payouts have increased. In fact, most of what people uh, get for payouts in terms of their mining is because of the price in altcoins in relation to Bitcoin. Because honestly, most people who are home mining are mining those altcoins. And unfortunately, the, the price variance between Bitcoin and these other altcoins is continuing to expand in the opposite direction. So while the price of Bitcoin and what those of us who are mining via uh, NiceHash are receiving in Bitcoin, while that value may be higher than it normally would, the fact of the matter is, because we're mining a coin that isn't worth as much, we're getting less overall. I don't know if that made any sense at all. It seemed to make sense in my head, but even as it came out of my mouth, it was a little confusing. So, brass tacks here. What are we seeing in terms of numbers? What I'm getting as of right now, it's 6.26 p.m. on March. Wow, March? What month is this? This is May. Uh, 6.26 p.m. on May 10th. It is showing me that I'm getting 0.0006 BTC per day, which translates to approximately uh, $3.98. So four bucks a day total between my two rigs. Not great. Not really, not really viable here. So... I'm probably going to run through the weekend, at least until this next round of payouts. Uh, today's the 10th. It looks like my next payout is the 13th, which is estimated to be around uh, um, 0.0014 Bitcoin, or about $9.30. So I'll probably go until the 13th, get that paid out, and then I may just turn down the rigs again, uh, unless I figure out... Uh, some way that it makes sense monetarily to keep running. So that's where we are right now for this Friday afternoon. I'll check back in uh, on the 13th to see what this final payout is. But as of right now, it's estimating $9.32. And that's also given a Bitcoin that is currently worth uh, $6,322. 
So I will see you on the 13th, but until then, I am Eric the Red. This has been Crypto for the Caffeinated. Uh, see you next time. Yeah. <laughs>